Welcome back to Let's Play Traitor's Keep, the DLC package for Fable 3. I'm Burning Dogface, and we're here hunting Witchcraft Mary Godwin. Hello, what have we there? Get in the damn water. So what the hell is that? Oh, I guess that's a trigger. This can't be a good combination. So much for Mary Godwin. So this is necromantic alchemy. I am genuinely disappointed. Enough! You have turned yourself into the one enemy I am most capable of defeating. It doesn't even make a lick of sense. Not even by this game's usual standards. Fine, how do you like it, huh? Huh? Them, you dumbass! The hell is wrong with you? And now a Valverine whistle. You think you have the right to destroy us? We are the essence of power. We are stronger. We are more. I was wondering about that. No, they could have done something really cool and made an original model for the boss. It was some sort of horrible hybrid of those three things. But no, they just made me fight those three things in a different order. Hell breaks loose. Milton 
can get your damn weapon out. Thank you. It's not like I haven't fought a lot of all three of these enemies before. The hybrid thing would have been cool. For a minute there, I was really looking forward to this. She's human no, again. Not this form again. I can take that. Please don't let me live this way. Kill me, I beg you. She doesn't know what she's saying. We should take her back to the keep. She needs special care. Don't worry. Everything's going to be all right. I think these people are just loonies. Not sure how uh, the general could find much use for them. We'll do what we can for her. When she's well enough, perhaps we can send her to a more adequate facility. She needs more help than we can give her. We still need to find General Turner. I'll meet you in the records room. Perhaps Hobson and my men have uncovered his location. You found the second prisoner. Have you ever wondered what your nature is? Misguided and disturbed as she may be, Witchcraft Mary never intended to harm anyone except perhaps herself. She can now get the help she needs, and who knows, her research may prove useful one day. See her your research being as uh, handy as the Faraday's. All oh, right, yeah, there is a sta uh, statue, a painting of the uh, general in there. Did we send the uh, professor back to his island? Well. What happened? It was Turner. He's been here all along. He never left the island. Well, where's Hobson? He took him. Turner's been playing with us, playing with you. This is what he wanted all along, to lure you into a trap. He's been using hidden passages behind the walls. He's somewhere in the prison. I don't care what happens to Hobson. But Me we'll neither. Have to find Turner. He left through here. Why would he free his men, only to have us bring them back? Jump cut. Alright, that's better. I know it's a trap, but I'm not sure Turner realizes who he's dealing with. He hasn't seen you fight like I have. We should be careful. He must have something prepared for us. I should have gone back to town about some more potions. Oh, well, thanks. <clears throat> I feel a bit dehydrated today.
This is the pit. If he's hiding with all these lunatics. Oh dear. semi-medieval setting. It's not like there's a master control panel somewhere. Peter, finish him! Good. At least they're out of their misery now. You're hurt. I'll be all right. I'm no hero. Though. I have a whole bunch Steve. of healing potions if you need them. I can deal with Turner alone. I'm sure you can. You have powers the rest of us can only dream of. There might be more coming. Go. I'll hold them off while I can. How could there be more coming? You're in a dead end. Aw, oh, man. Oop, corner. Looked at my timer at just the wrong point. Oh, dear. Something bad's gonna happen when we run up. It always works that way, and we all know it. Might as well get it over with. It's all right, Thompson. No, it isn't. It's a trap. Oh shit! It's time for your treatment, Your Majesty. No! You're awake, Your Majesty. Good. I was afraid I might have set too high a charge. But then, you have powers the rest of us can only dream of. Hobson was mistaken. There was a third prisoner. General Turner, the 
finest soldier I ever served under, the finest man I ever knew, died six months ago. I guess I was wrong Couldn't and right. Life, but I wasn't going to let everything he believed in die with him. You see, it's time for a true revolution. And how does one bring down a king? How does one bring down a hero? Not by becoming by a becoming villain. One. Forgive me, your majesty. Mary's research. Of course. Kings and Queens. a military coup, but I've had a better idea. I will simply take your place. I've seen how you behave. I've seen how you fight, how you make decisions. I know how to be you. And as King of Albion, I will end the crown forever. I watched Turner rot in his cell too sick to save him. I took care of him as best I could. And I learned the truth about our supposedly glorious Albion. Two identical heroes can't overcome each other. We would be locked in battle forever, always evenly matched. But I made sure the prisoners on this floor did some of my work. Now I'm stronger. Are you done yet? These powers time and again. But to feel them coursing through me, it's incredible. You seem to work when you spared Faraday's life. But as long as you wear the crown, you are the enemy of the people. I know many who wouldn't have taken pity on Mary. But that doesn't mean you should decide the fate of a whole country. A soldier must do what is necessary to protect his nation. When I sit on the throne of Albion, I will reverse every bad decision you ever made. And then I will free the people from the rule of the crown. It's a pity you won't see such a glorious day. The people of Albion will rule themselves. 
and the army will be there. A hero isn't made by blood or genetics or magic. Heroes are bred in the soul. And you, buddy, you don't have what it takes. My turn. Every bad decision I have ever made. You really can't see that there's no difference between me and Logan. I said that wrong, but I'm mad, so I don't care. And if you really don't think that a king can possibly do the right thing, then you're just as blind as Walter was. Deserve those wings. Heroes aren't chances of luck. We get their powers to roll of the dice. Albion chooses them. Halt, for the time of the hammer is upon you. I was never going to let you near my family. Another revolution has failed. Perhaps it's as it should be. I don't know that I could ever have given up such power. Just remember this, King. Albion doesn't need you to sit on his throne. One day the people will claim their freedom. What a douche. Who are you? There is no third prisoner, or perhaps it's you, sitting on that throne forevermore. Traitors keep heroes and villains. Milton's attempted coup has failed, but you have been confronted with questions that have no easy answer. <clears throat> are you a hero or a politician? A rebel or a monarch? Only you know who you really are. For now, your place on the throne is safe, and Raven Scar Keep is yours to do with as you wish. That was quite an extraordinary and most unpleasant turn of events, if you don't mind me saying so. I never did trust Commander Milton, of course, but to attempt a coup by taking your place, why, it's diabolical. His death should serve as an example to all. And to think he was loyal to a traitor like General Turner. We should be thankful the General was a rather sick man when he was imprisoned, or Milton might have let him walk free. Prison management for beginners. New quests? If you're not too busy, you might have a look in the... Well, we've run over time already. So I'm going to cut it here. I very strongly suspect that the next episode of Let's Play Traitor's Keep will be the last one. I'm Burning Dogface, and I'll see you then.